Yes, yes, calm down. <laughs> Okay, welcome back everybody to Jack's World of Wildlife. Now today, we're looking for turtles. Now, we've done this before. We've not had much luck looking for snapping turtles at this exact location. I will attach that, that video up, up here. I'll attach a card, so look for it. It'll pop up and it'll say, worst episode ever. That, that video, we were looking for snapping turtles, didn't find any, but it's warm today. It's good weather. We might find something. So. We're gonna look around and, um, oh my gosh, actually. <laughs> look at this. This is not what we're looking for, but this is a little red-eared slider. It looks to be no more than maybe a few weeks old. Not even any growth on the scoots there. Um, snapping turtles will eat these, um, actually, like a chicken nugget. I won't, because I'd probably get salmonella and like I'm not even sure what, dysentery, probably. So I'd probably get pretty dehydrated from all the diarrhea. So I'm not gonna eat this turtle. Um, but he's very cute, look at him. Not what we're looking for though. We're looking for something bigger. So hopefully there's gonna be some larger snapping turtles here this time. That'd be great if they could be here this time. So fingers crossed. And uh, let's get to looking. We'll let him go. I'm not gonna just chuck him. <laughs> just plop him in the water. There you go, buddy. You can go. You are free. Go. Go. Go, go, go. Go, go, go. Wow, okay. He's not the smartest by any means, but you know, are we, are we profound? Okay, so we've actually just found this little slide here. Now it might not look like much, but you see these claw marks. That is a good sign. There's a very real possibility that judging off of the size and the style, of the slide that this could be some snapping turtle activity. So, I'm hopeful, I'm grateful, I'm reflecting, and I'm hoping that we're gonna find something today. All right, let's go! Boom, are you filming? Are you filming? Yes. Are you filming? Oh my gosh, guys! The wrong thing. Another red-eared slider, except this one's way uglier. Way smellier. Way dumber. And way mo moss mossier. Or algier. Algier. Algeria. Oh. All right, I don't want him. Blah, blah. Okay, let's let's find what we're what we're here to find, right, folks? I'm sure you're at home wondering, what the heck? I want something good here. I want something with the, some meat on the bones of this video. I'm not interested in another idiot video about not snapping turtles. I want to find one. I want to see one. Well, have you come to the wrong place, or right place, depending on if if we find one? I, I hope right. I hope the right place. All right, okay, so uh, there's actually another baby ready to slider over here, which I'll show you because he's cute. It's a red-eared slider, very common, very common type of creature, very common. Did I trick you? I trick you good? Not gonna eat him again, diarrhea, don't want it. Uh-oh, uh he's, 
He's also a bit challenged. There, there you go, buddy. Oh, oh, oh. There, there you go. There you go. Keep your mouth right, chap. Okay. Aha! A clue! And what have we here, mate? We found one! We found it! Look! It's a real live snapper turtle! We did it! <laughs> We've actually found one! Oh my lord! <laughs> and now we have to figure out which end is his business in. That's the part I don't want to grow with me, and Okay, which side are you on? <laughs> Wake up! Wake up! He's really in there! He's really in there, folks! Oh, there you are, there you are. Alright, alright, alright. Easy, easy, mate, easy, mate. I've got to rinse you off. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, sure, sure. Oi! 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 Easy, there, bugger. Easy. Ta-da! This is Kiladra Serpentina, or the common snapping turtle. I'm gonna rinse him off. He's a bit muggy. Ah! Easy, easy. As you can see, he's a snapper. As the name might suggest, he's a snapping turtle, and he stinks. <laughs> ah! Easy. Easy lad, Ugh, I'll come out from the tunnel. Come out from the tunnel. Okay. Easy. Ah, uh, lovely trash in the background. Lovely trash. Okay. This is what we've been waiting for. Now this right here is a common snapping turtle. I wonder if it's echoing through this cave behind us. This right here is a common snapping turtle. One of the largest freshwater turtles you can encounter here in North America. Its primitive structure also aids it in its lifestyle. A large size is quite useful when you're a turtle. Uh oh, uh oh. Choo -choo -choo. So beautiful. Lovely. Gorgeous. Hi. Hi. The snapping turtles have a powerful bite because they're fat. See all this fat, meaty legs sticking out from their shell? Their shell's not that great of a defense. So they have adapted a powerful bite and an impressive reach with their neck. They have a very long neck, which is where that species name Serpentina comes from. It means snake-like. So they are able to inflict a very powerful bite, which is why I'm holding him on the plastron, uh, which is the underside of his shell. Because he can't reach me from there. It's also much safer than suspending them from the tail, which um, is very painful for a snapping turtle and can cause them to even dislocate parts of their vertebra, which is sad. We don't want to hurt them. No, we want to enjoy them. We want to experience them. Hi. Touch them. <laughs> Not to be weird, I do love to catch turtles though. You're very cute. Very, very cute. You're heavy. Now, common snapping turtles are actually super interesting because they range from all the way down here in the bottom part of the United States all the way up into Canada. So they can be quite cold resistant. Now they eat a variety of things. Anything they can pretty much catch if in their mouths. They'll eat ducklings, other turtles, frogs, snakes, fish, of course, crayfish, crawdads, mud bugs, whatever you want to call them. And of course, if you threw your McDonald's Happy Meal in the water, they would probably go ham on it. Hey, I'm not a Happy Meal. I'm not a Happy Meal, mate. I'm not a Happy Meal. Oh, he's just a little nervous. <laughs> he's just a little nervous. It's all right. You're fine. Safety. Safety. Friendship. Kindness. 
think he's getting the gist. All right, but we'll let him go on his way and see if we can catch an even bigger one. Because there are bigger fish. There's always a bigger fish. All right, love you, bye. <gasps> Look at all this mud. You mucky bugger, aren't you? Let, let, him, let, him, let him bug off. Let him bug off. You're good. You, you go wherever you want. All right. So, we are going to traverse the mighty vines of Moria and hopefully find a bigger slapping turtle. Come along. It's a bit lucky. Oh, yes. Look. I might need my monthly shower after this. A clam graveyard. Fresh. Come along. There's not much time. Come along, hurry. Get on your hunches and move faster. Don't make sounds. Foolish! Foolish! Wow. Look. Nothing. Um. Not to worry. There are still other little things we can. We can look. We can look through. I'm sure there's good. There's a good chance of finding something. Okay. I'm just surveying. It's dead. Uh oh. <laughs> That's unfortunate. Part of the circle of life is that um, somewhere in the circle, the circle disconnects and the things that were in the circle of life die. Sorry for the children who are just now learning about death. It's a very real part of the animal kingdom. We all must return to the dirt. Anyway, let's go! Hang on. That could be a turtle's head. Shall we investigate? Come quickly now. Quickly! Okay, I'm going to prepare you guys. From where I'm standing, it looks like not a turtle head at all, but a piece of trash. So emotionally prepare yourself if you find yourself or a loved one disappointed. Alright, I think I'm ready. It, uh, it was 100% a piece of trash. Oh, wow. Okay. This is Jack's World of Wildlife, not uh, trash World of Wildlife. So, we shall carry on. What we need. All right, spell it with me, folks. B O R I N G. Ready to slide up. Let's go to the east in the larger pool of the pond. Make like Mr. Leahy and frig off. Recipes. I have a feeling. Ooh, ooh, that night's gonna be a good night. That's enough. Oh, wait a second. That's not what I want. It's a turtle! <laughs> Gonna swing from the chandelier. From the chandelier. Can't go that high. Sorry, folks. Sorry, I started too high. That was on me, but uh, you reap what you sow. Wow. 
once again, profound. We're like trolls. Trolls. Hungry for meat. we found in our troll cave. He doesn't look very healthy. He's not really moving. So that's not very good. He's a little floppy. Oh, he had some life in him after all. Praise. Right, let's go find that other snapping turtle because I don't think we're going to find any more and I have a few more facts I want to tell you about them. All right. Uh. Ow! Where are you, love? Where are you, me? I can't imagine he was smart enough to move back to where he was, but because I'm not smart enough to rule that out as an option, that's where we're going to look first. I'm a maniac. I'm a maniac on the floor And I'm dancing like I never danced before Maniac, maniac on the floor And I'm dancing like I've never danced before Well, um, here's a turtle Once again, a dumb radiant slider. Much anger fills her soul. Yummy. Okay. Just as I suspected. Well. Just as I suspected, they did not return. Therefore, we must search downstream. Hmm. It's rather murky. Jack, sort of wildlife pro tip. If you're gonna start looking downstream, you should probably do it before you stir up all the sediment upstream and make the water very hard to see through. Pro tip number 417. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. Now I have lost the snapping turtle. So I'm lost in the bog. North to south. Rise left when he's not there. Now I know you might know. Cause I am lost in a bog. Technically it's not a bog, but it serves my rhyming scheme purposes. Yeah, <laughs> stupid dog. Ruining my video. Disrespect. Disrespect. Man, I'll find him. Never give up hope. I don't think he quite made it this far. No, he's probably under the mud somewhere. Um, we might have better luck retracing our steps. I hate to say it, but... Maybe. I think he's probably back up the other way. You've got a little dirt on your neck. Oh! Where? where? Lovely. Here? Which way? Yes. <laughs> God, that <help me. laughs> What? Are you doing in my swamp? Attention, all 
fairy tale things. You have officially overstayed your welcome. I'm gonna talk to whoever this Farquaad guy is and get you all off my land and back where you came from. Shrek, 2001. Solid movie. Shrek, if you're watching, I'm open for sponsors, so. Thousands of children die every year in the swamps. Help your child be aware of the dangers that could be lurking in acidic wetlands. Thank you. What will our snapping turtle friend do? When we saw him last, he was resting in this shallow patch of water. Has he gone upstream? Has he gone downstream? Has he had another run-in with the Foxtrot boys? Find out this week on Jack's World of Wildlife. 980 Central. I know, it comes on late, wow. Sounds like an old person show. I had another run-in with the Foxtrot boys. I wouldn't want to have a run-in with the Foxtrot boys. They, they sound like uh, a gang of trouble. What the heck? Why is this idiot always following? Go home, Sam. Go home, Sam. Sam. Go home. You know, I'm not usually a very confrontational person, but these waterproof, snake-proof boots are no longer waterproof. Faulty. False. I don't think mine are working either. I just noticed I'll probably reference Lord of the Rings quite a lot in this episode. Which is strange. Carry on. I'm just feeling a bit discouraged, mate. We had him. I was hopeful we might find more. But of course, he was the only one we could find. And I didn't say everything I wanted to say. Oh. So I'm feeling a bit discouraged. A bit. Have you seen my son? Nemo. 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 Sadly, we were not able to find the snapper turtle we found originally. He seems to have buggered off, which is fine. Because I'm going to tell you a few facts about snapping turtles, and then we're going to end the program. Snapping turtles are the second largest freshwater turtle in North America, second to the alligator snapping turtle. They are quite feisty. They inhabit much of the United States. They are large. The only real predator after a certain size is people. And they're very, very cool. Now, if you direct your attention down this way, I happen to notice Another very nice looking baby Radiant Slider. So in with this. Radiant Sliders are cute when they're babies. And then when they get older, they are boring and yucky. Just kidding. Got you again, didn't I? 
All right, so we're gonna let him, we're gonna let him run free. Goodbye. I love you. Namaste. And thank you.